Le Triomphe de l'Amour by Pierre de Marivaux is a captivating exploration of love's complexities set against a backdrop of disguise, mistaken identities, and the interplay between reason and passion. Published in 1732, this play is renowned for its nuanced portrayal of human emotions and societal conventions. The narrative unfolds with Princess Leonide, who disguises herself as a man named Phocian to gain access to the secluded domain of Aegis, the rightful heir to the throne. Through her cunning, Leonide aims to infiltrate Aegis's world to win his love and overturn the legacy of enmity between their families. Marivaux adeptly employs the theme of disguise to illustrate the multifaceted nature of love. Leonide's transformation into Phocian not only serves as a plot device but also highlights the fluidity and complexity of human emotions. Central to the story is the conflict between reason and passion. Leonide's strategic approach to love contrasts sharply with Aegis's adherence to reason and duty. Aegis, raised in isolation and shielded from the influences of the outside world, represents the logical and controlled aspect of love. His commitment to duty and skepticism toward emotions create a stark contrast to Leonide's impulsive and emotionally driven actions. Marivaux skillfully weaves a tapestry of mistaken identities and romantic entanglements, blurring the lines between reality and illusion. The interactions between Leonide slash Phocian and Aegis, along with their respective retinues, create a web of romantic intrigue, adding layers of complexity to the narrative. These intricate relationships serve as a canvas for exploring the intricacies of human emotions, desires, and societal expectations. Furthermore, the play delves into the transformative power of love. As Leonide navigates the challenges posed by her disguise, her actions and experiences gradually reshape her understanding of love. Similarly, Aegis's rigid convictions are challenged as he confronts the conflicting emotions stirred by Leonide's presence. Through their interactions, Marivaux explores the potential for love to break down barriers, challenge preconceived notions, and prompt personal growth. The resolution of the play marks a triumph of love over societal conventions and entrenched animosities. The revelation of identities, the unraveling of deceit, and the characters' acceptance of their feelings culminate in a harmonious union that transcends the barriers of class and familial discord. Marivaux crafts a denouement that celebrates the transformative and unifying power of love while underscoring the limitations of rigid societal structures. In conclusion, Le Triomphe de l'Amour is a masterful exploration of love, deception, and societal expectations. Marivaux's intricate narrative, rich character development, an exploration of the interplay between reason and passion elevate this play to a timeless examination of human nature. Through its portrayal of love's triumph, the play resonates with audiences across centuries, inviting reflection on the complexities of relationships and the enduring power of love to overcome adversity.